Locandro in Vidiana Locandro Sanupreni Ademi Ape Anuruddha Andru Rasia Kano Anna Kubalan Anuruddha Andru Rasia So, Nanda Dehandra, you can explain the situation or you can give the answer because you are, you are saying something I heard. No, I so, said sense consciousness. Sense consciousness. Consci no, this is. This the consciousness is, of the senses. Yes. Uh, uh, <coughs> we are talking about I sense do. Yeah. Not the sense, but the sense do. Yeah. Not about I consciousness, but yeah. about I. Mm. So how you explain uh, how you yes how you clarify this question <coughs> answer uh, what we what would be the answer from you from me no no from Nandu ah, afterwards so you can answer ena vinita andre kiyanwa i think if the buddha wanted to mean i consciousness you would have say of I consciousness. Mm. So uh, for me, it's a bit dangerous to go like too bit far. Mm. But you no, know, you said actually the even the physical is impermanent. Really impermanent means like uh, even if you don't consider the abhidhamma, even according to the like Western science, there is nothing permanent even for one moment in the. Life. So like, I don't think we have to go as far as. Like, 
because there is a bunch of suttas and it's very nice. According to my memory, sometimes the Buddha then goes to say even the feeling born of this is impermanent and so on. So in those suttas, definitely you know that uh, he was talking about the physical part. So for me, that's that's the, the answer. The most b bigger problem is that most people would not agree with some of the, like the monks when they reply, the Buddha asks, Oh, monks, is the eye permanent or impermanent? So this is impermanent, so most people will agree with that. Then the <clears throat> Buddha says, like, and uh, is it suffering or like... Uh, what is impermanent? This impermanent subject to change, is it suffering or like pleasure? So then they say suffering with this part, already some people would not agree. And then he says, what is impermanent subject to change and suffering? Can, we, can it be called self or belonging to self? Then they say no, and, but most people will say yes. So, so I think for the people, is, this one is the problem they need to discuss, not, not that if it's the physical art. And actually, not, before to go to people's idea, but um, if you directly go to the sutta, when Buddha asks you, whether I is permanent or impermanent, you will say I is impermanent. So what is that I? This is the problem. <coughs> is it this side? If this side, when I touch, I should have eye consciousness, but it doesn't have eye consciousness. Oh, chakvinyane hatagannayane, then meya he monahari hapuna, meya he rupa. Oh, kaivinyane. So, so, hmm? so as a rupa can also be. Oh, uh, rupa tien no, no, the me, 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 rupa pain, ne? Mm. Rupa pain, eh, me, come on, me. And some are ladder, under, under, in, egulan, me, eh, hunter, tien, or pain. Even so, we need to have the can you translate? Nice. <laughs> so, the discussion was. Uh, what so the market said no we should really go to the eye even before the impermanence so now if you touch the like eye bulb so uh, then you should have some consciousness there but it's not like that so the market is pointing out some blind people they have the eyeballs are healthy but still they cannot see so then the question is what is really the eye then even now we uh, touch the eye, we, ha we, can, uh, we can have body consciousness, not the eye consciousness. So this physical eye must not be the eye that Buddha question about whether it is permanent or impermanent. It is not this, this phys physical eye, but it is not 100% not this physical eye because ability of seeing also depending on this physical yes, life. So this is the thing we have to clarify. And the ear, when we look at the ear, ear is this according to normal convention. But when we touch, this, this ear can't hear. Yeah, but it's <laughs> earlobe. Huh? That's the, not the it's ear. ear. It's earlobe. Yeah. It's not yeah. the ear. No, he's it, talking about the drum. I it, think drum and thing. But uh, when when we are looking at the sutta, Buddha doesn't say ear drum or anything. He just say ear. Mm -hmm. When we yeah. say ear, this is the ear. Yeah. But and when we to look at the uh, next one, nose. Nose means this is the nose, not but, something uh, uh, subtle or anything else according to sutta. But Bhante, when he talks about contact, he doesn't say this type of contact. He says contact of the sensitive part in the eye and forms that appear there, not, not touching the, with the... That's the thing we have to clarify, because in the Sutta, Buddha doesn't say uh, kind of uh, subtle another eye or uh, another something. Mm. When, you look at, when you look at the Sutta, it simply talk about, we understand, it simply talk about the eyes we can, we can see now. We, uh, ears, nose, tongue, very obvious things, according, uh, according to Sutta, that's the way I understand. Uh, I understand means that's the way a normal person can understand it. So, 
महानिनीन <laughs> अहमुखाद <laughs> කාන මොකද්ද නහය දිව ශරීරය මොකද්ද කියන එක තමයි ප්‍රශ්නේ අනිත් එක දැන් බුදුරජාන්ස යහන ප්‍රශ්නෙට හාමුදුරුවරු නිත්‍යද අනිත්‍යද කියලා අනිත්‍යයි කියලා උත්තරක් දෙනවා ඒ හාමුදුරු අනිත්‍යයි කියලා මොකද්ද දකින්නේ කොහොමද ඒ හාමුදුරු ඇහ අනිත්‍යයි කියලා දකින්නේ කො කාන අනිත්‍යයි නහය අනිත්‍යයි කියලා දකින්නේ අන්න ඒකයි ප්‍රශ්නේ සෝ ඉනිත හාමුදුරු ෂු කැන් ටෙල් මී සෝ So the Buddha asks them: Is the eye impermanent, and uh, ear impermanent, nose impermanent, tongue impermanent, body impermanent? So <clears throat> uh, the Buddha does not really like. It seems like it is referring to the normal eyeball and the ear, or earlobe and the tongue and the nose and the body. And the monks say it is impermanent. So the question here is. when the buddha is asking about the what eye or ear or what not is does he mean by that and what the monks saw as the eye or ear or what not that they said that was impermanent then api me me ha me apita pena ha tamai e budurajana se adhas karanne kiyala ahuwot ehema ehema api hituwot then me हटगा सोत विज्ञान हटगा सीमेंगे <coughs> likewise with the ear we have like ear lobe and then the, there is uh, this like uh, drum and the other things inside which is like quite big part also so when we talk about the ear do we really talk about that so is what we call the ear only not all the parts are actually functioning for the uh, like sound vinyana and the consciousness of hearing likewise with the nose so it, the 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 nose is kind of big but not all the parts of the nose are doing the smelling really so the marketa suggests we should have like uh, we should have a look at the, the eye and what what parts it has and uh, consider that 
Then likewise for the ear and so on. Then me. Again, at the end, sutra kotsa karam bello hamne chakkuncha patichcha rupee chupajiti chakkuinya naan kila tena tiye na. Ita kotha. Ee ha kiya na ek sambandeng. Hati ende ve na roop ekatu enna to ne kate chakkuinya na hata karna. Anni tika siddha ve na tena ta tamai ee ha kiya la hariya tamai kiya na. So, so in <clears throat> in suttas you can see this definition conditioned by the eye and the form uh, the eye consciousness arises so from that we can get some understanding what is meant by the eye eto kota e chakku vinyana hata ganna tena thamai aha ekata api kiyanne chakku prasade kiyala ehema to me mulu aha guliyama neme i don't agree <laughs> Because if you don't have the gulia, you can also you cannot see also. Yes, yes. That's why this is very subtle thing. Without having gulia, you can't have uh, chakku pasad. So there is. A... But chakku pasad is not healthy. Gulia tip but where done? Chakku inya na hata ganne. So there is a, a sensitive matter there. Uh, uh, is um, it is a chakku? No, no. Chakku pasad. Yeah. Chakku pasad. Yeah. It's called like uh, uh, let's say eye sensitive matter, yes. which is not like part of all the part of the eye or the eyeball, but if that sensitive matter is not functioning, even if the rest of the eye is okay, still you cannot see anything. Eva ke me chakku pasade tamai chakku vinyana eh ma tan roop roopai ahai chakku vinyana ei kia na tuna ekatu vinni ko kriyat ma ka vinni. ये चाकू पसार देगी ना तेरा। Or you can say the place where the form and the मुकदमे तो ना। आई रूपाई चाकू इन्हीं ना। The eye, the eye consciousness and the <coughs> form gets like meets in one place and that one place is the uh, sensitive. Uh, I sensitive method. Oh, ये का तमाही सब एविन में है कि ये लकी आंदर है। So Dr. Tamara Kitan is saying this is what we can call the real eye there. ये विधि है तो आप इटा खाना क्या नात पहले दिल कराने पड़ों दें खाना की ये लकी आंदर में पीटा टा पेन एक आरी में तुले कैली कैली ओको में ये वा ऐसे मने में ही साद्दाई सोता प्रसाद याई चाकू इन्याने एकतुए ना तैनात हुए ना इकटा एक है सोतो इन्याने एकटे एकतुए ना तैनात हुए ना अन्य तीन तो तमाही खाना किया लकी आने द मैं खाना मैं होंदर तीपोत ये ऐतुले क्या है लतुआल वेला ना चाकू इन्याना हटागा नहीं ना तब खाना ने ये वाके में देंग ये सोता प्रसाद एक क्रियात्मक सेबेविन में कहना किया लगी आना है नहीं सोता प्रसाद है। Likewise for the ear, so if if some other parts of the ear are damaged, you still cannot get the sound, but they are like assisting the the like the real ear there is is again where the sound and the hearing consciousness and this sent eye sorry ear meat is the Ear sensitive matter, but uh, no, ear uh, meat means no. This is because be ah meat meat. Ah, this, but ah, these right. three meat ah, ear right. meets all the kind of parts of the ear, but uh, the 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 real real ear is really what the market says is the uh, sensitive matter of the ear. Yes, again, sebab aku makan kaya ni, yang tanah ke soto inya ni hata ganna ada, ane tanah tamai kana. So because it is really where the ear consciousness arises, that is the real ear. Dah api meh luat soto inya ni hata ganne, meh mana hari ya puno. Sadha puno at meh, maape yatha puno at meh soto inya ni hata ganne. Ikan dah meh ke sebab aku makan kaya kaya ni. So, because the argument is this: is you flick your earlobe, you do you don't get the sound from that because uh, that part of the ear has no ability to hear anything. Hmm. Ito kote anit ayatan tikat oyasurema te irungga na pulua. So, likewise, the other uh, uh, 
sense basis should be understood the same way etakota den onna apita dala adahasak endo ona me wena vita attatama aha kiyala kiyanne me aha bolema nemei namuth aha bolet udawu sahitawa aha atule tiyena chakku vinyane hata ganna tanata thamai aha kiyala kiyanne so Likewise for the ear and the nose and the other parts. इतने घटे इतने वस्से में दें अभी तेरुंगा तक किया हमको हर है बैठ में है किया ने इतना ही खाना किया ने इतना ही हम किया ला इतने को कानी क्या ही किया ला अभी तो पेन ने को हम So even so let's say that we have clear out the first part what is the eye ear and so on so then the seeing the impermanence there how that is managed. दें में अभी तो में है ना अभी वायस ऐसे आना करते दूर वाले वेला स्पेन ने कि लापी किया ना हम कतांदर अभी किया ना है इधर से खाना खाना तो ना कांग्य है ने वायस ऐसे आना करते हम किया लगी ना को काने ले डाक के दिला कांग्य है ने कि ले हम किया ना दीवाता दें वे लोग को हम दूर किया ने रास्ता देने ने कि लगे ना बेहत निसारी � मैं ऐंगटा देने नहीं कि ना ऐंगल वाइस अर्गी ला रैली वेट ला गुरो सुना हम इतिंग है डायबिटीज़ है वो डायबिटीक नहीं साथ हीरी वेटे ना हम तीन ना इतिहास तो वट ए वे ए अनित्य आते हैं मतलब विपरी नाम ये वे पैराली हम एक बलागा ना भी वाइस अटे आना काम इन्दे वे ना सो लाइक वी कैन लूज द sensitivity in the body but usually it happens uh, when we get somehow sick or mostly those things happen only when we grow quite old so you might say we can see even the change in that fact in those faculties only once we are getting old eh eto hote thing me then ewe anithyatwaya bala ganna දැන් බුදුරජාණන්සේ කාලේ හොඳටම තරුණව ඉන්ද්‍රිය ඔක්කොම හොඳට තියෙන හා අඳුරුරු අනිත්‍ය අනිත්‍ය කියලා තේරුම් කරන්න රහත් වුණා නේ කොහොමද ඒක වෙන්නේ so then the buddha himself and the monks he met with many of them were like in the prime of their their youth with all the faculties unimpaired and working on the like uh, the best way they could still they managed to become arahat seeing the impermanence ඔව් දැන් බුදුරජාණන්සේ අවුරුදු 35 දී තමයි එහෙ අනිත්‍යයි කියලා දැක්කේ. කන අනිත්‍යයි නහය දිව ශරීරයේ අනිත්‍යයි කියලා අවුරුදු 35 හොඳ හොඳ තරුණ කාලේ තමයි දැක්කේ. So the Buddha or actually like between the Bodhisattva and Buddha time uh, the that person managed to see the impermanence about the eye ear and so on truly and that's when he became the Buddha. And he was 35, so it was everything was really working the best way. Again, that means that he was not able to do anything. So that is what something that needs to be clarified. It is our Obahan say that when he is in a certain low order, he is not able to do anything. Or, or, he is not able to do anything. Low order, he is not able to do anything. 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 लोकोत्तर लोकोत्तर 
එතකොට දැන් ඒ අර කතාවන් මතක තියා ගන්න රූප 28ක් තියනවනේ ඒ රූප මොකක්ක ලෝකෝත්තර නැහැ ඒ ඔක්කොම ලෞකික ලෝකෝත්තර ධර්ම නමේ අයිනේ තියෙන්නේ ලෝකෝත්තර ධර්ම නමේ මොනවද මතක් කරන්න බලන්න ඉතින් සනාද මේ අපි ධර්මය අවශ්‍ය ධර්මය අවබෝධ කරන්න उटिंग <laughs> and in that connection there was this talk like which sounded like super mundane i or something so that <clears throat> then venerable the market they pointed out there is no form that is super mundane the, there are uh, recognized nine super mundane things that are the four paths for fruitions and nibbana there are the only super mundane things so there is no f- f- kind of form that is super mundane but <clears throat> so then it was clarified that those monks were t- saying when you see this like kind of very specific uh, subtle level about the eye uh, together with the cessation which is on the part path or it, it's directly the path of the supramundane then that is that level so then the market they am said that can be like said <clears throat> because it is on the way to the towards the super mundane that leads there that you need to kind of really see those things hmm etakota dan me e apita adahasak kawane sabae ha kiyanne mokadda kiyala e aha therun ganna kota me ehena sabae winna roopa sabae winna chakku vinyana sabae winma kana e wageema sabae winma sadda sota vinyana kiyala ehema apita ara sabae winma kiyana man achane adahas kene ganna परमार्थ वशेंगे paramatta level that is the ultimate truth or the true reality then ehema na to samuti vashayen api eha therun gattot me karana pahadili wenne den samuti vashayen tiyena eha gana me samanya loke goda dewal tiyena lassana es kiyena nilipullas kiyala kiyena me muwa denaka ge es kiyala gaga kiyena ehema e eha therun gattot meka karanna wenne kana gana to wage tiyena den ara amba pali कॉन्वेंशन <laughs> that the samuti and panyati that is convention and designation or concept level of uh, things you cannot really understand those things like <clears throat> there is in terigata uh, that's the verses of the elder nuns there is one from the ambapali that she used to be like courtesan mm. so so i think what the marakita amri was saying was first she says how beautiful she was when she was doing what whatever before she became a nun so so there she really talks about the normal like conventional eye ear and so on me etagata den den api the igara kalpana karanna ona kohomada me paramartha washeen tiyena aha kana nase diwa sharire anitya washeen therun ganna so then the question is how how do we see this e i e r and so on in the ultimate level uh, reality ekata athabai me apita therena sammuti tattwe indamma aarambhayak ganna puluwa but we can start going into that direction using first the conventional normal level e mokata den ape ape samanya buddhiyata therena 
මේ s2 y සට යනකොට pn නැතු යනවා ඊට කලින් s වල ලෙඩ හැදෙනවා තුවාල වෙනවා ඉතින් ඒව වෙලා ඇහ ඇහේ පෙනීම නැති වෙලා යන එකක් කියලා අපිට දැන් සාමාන්‍ය බුද්ධියට උනත් තේරුම් ගන්න පුළුවන් ඒකත් එතකොට අර නිවන් මාර්ගයේ පැත්තේම තමයි තියෙන්නේ දැන් මේ කොච්චර හොඳ s3 වුණත් ලස්සන s3 වුණත් තරුණ අයගේ s3 වුණත් ඕවයි කෝ ලෙඩ වෙලා තුවාල වෙලා ඇක්සිඩන්ට් එකක් වෙලා කැඩිලා බිඳිලා යන්නත් පුළුවන් එහෙම නැතත් වයසට යනකොට කොහොමත් s පෙනීම නැති වෙලා යනවා ඒක නම් මේ ඇහැ කියන එක නිත්‍ය දෙයක් නෙවෙයි සදාතනික s පෙනීම කියන එක තියෙන්නේ නැහැ කියලා සාමාන්‍ය බුද්ධියෙන් වුණත් යම් ප්‍රමාණයකට තේරුම් ගන්න පුළුවන් definitively this happens and uh, so there are uh, so there is like a normal common sense let's say which can understand how this seeing is something which is just temporary not something that is like uh, eternal or forever like last oh okay eta kota ekema thena seeing in me kiyala kiyana kota metana aha ඇහ සදාතනික නැහැ කියලා ඒ විදිහට කල්පනා කරලා තේරුම් ගන්න පුළුවන්. So when we say seeing that means the eye itself. දැන් ඊට පස්සේ අපිට තව ටිකක් කල්පනා කරලා තේරුම් ගන්න පුළුවන්. මේ මවුකුසට එන්න කලින් මේ ඇහ තිබුණොත් නැහැ. අපි මැරිලා පොළොවට පස්සුනාමත් මේ ඇහ නැහැ. එතකොට මේ මවුකුසේ දී හටගෙන මැරිලා පොළොවට පස්සුනාම ඉවර වෙලා යන ඇහක් අපිට තියෙනවා. කියලා හිතන්න පුළුවන්. Oh you can even sing at least this way. before uh like uh, so the the eyes were produced somewhere in the middle while being in the mother's womb and then when you are born you have the eyes and when you die those eyes are going like that's the end <coughs> of the eyes so there is like a expiry date on the eyes itself oh it's about it and that's what you know yeah because you are hey heart again you max ha we know she जीवित जीवित ගිය ජීවිතයයි මේ ජීවිතයයි ඊගාව ජීවිතයයි කියන කතා කරනවා නම් ඒ තමයි සූත්‍ර මට්ටම වෝහාර දේශනා කියන්නේ සෝ දා මරකිත හාමුදිස් නෝ සෙන් රිසින් ද සුත්තස් වොට දේ කෝල් ඉට් වෝහාර දේශනා විච් වී ඩොන්ට් හැව් ද ගුඩ් දිස් කයින් ඔෆ් කන්වෙන්ෂනල් ස්පීක් සම්තිං ලයික් දට් කන්වෙන්ෂන්ස් නෝ ඉස් වෝහාර මීන්ස් නෝර්මල් ටොක් ඇයි වෝ ජස්ට් යෙස් ජස්ට් නෝර්මල් ඉට්ස් ලයික් නෝර්මල් වේ ඔෆ් ස්පීකින් අබවුට් තින්ග්ස් which usually really considers like before life this life and the next life that kind of level of talking abidharmaya katha karanne sit kalin sitai vartamana sitai iga sita e vidihata katha karana na e kiyanne abidharma katha so the markita is saying that the, it is the abidama that talks about the before mind now mind and the ne- like next mind etakotta then sutra wala hema tissem wage tiyenne uh wohara desana so samuti desana so the sutta talk is the normal talk or the conventional talk uh then me prashne hondata visanda ganna haba e sutra mattame inda apita e abidharma pattata yanda wenawa so the markita says we cannot really understand this using the sutta level we have to really go to the abidharma level etta okay. जीवतेन्द्रियक्सादूपेन्द्रिय 
if you look at it from the Avedama standpoint, you have this, uh, um, I don't know the number. So, so it's the four and four and one and two. All together ten. ten. So it's the four basic elements, the four secondary uh, derived materiality together with uh, the life materiality, you know, life uh, faculty materiality and the sensitive materiality. Those, when those combine together, that's the, the thing where the, that, uh, uh, where the sen eye sensitive matter arises or the nose and so on. Dif they, they have the different sensitivity. So for the eyes, it's the, called the, like 10 of the eye. So that if when we said seeing the ultimate level, so the ultimate level about that that eye or the eye sensitive matter is seeing those ten uh, uh, with the ear, it's the uh, like ear ten and so on. So, according to Abhidhamma, this, the length in which the materiality particles, the length is, length, longest time it stays, it's uh, the, the 17, mind, 17 moments. mind moments. Is the lifespan of the longest lifespan of any materiality unit? Ita gorte chakku pasade ki ane ki digama kalya pavati na rupya chittakshana dahata. So according to that, <clears throat> the longest time you can have uh, uh, the eye sensitive matter units or particles or whatnot is seventeen mind moments. Ita gorte. Uh, so, so likewise for the ear, nose, tongue and body, the longest time those sensitive material units stay is at the most 17 mind moments. There are 17 mind moments kela kiyan ittaman no chuti kaale api espillanga hanu kata teva godak gihilu. So the 17 mind moments is extremely, it's like all of, I would say most like immeasurable time span really. They immeasurable, say, yeah, immeasurable times. No, because they say espilanga are caught, caught in Italian. Espilanga hana kotat eva goda gila. So like they say in one eye blink there is like amazing big numbers of the mind moments already gone. So that's why I said it's like almost immeasurable really. So in, if you consider that one, within the eye blinking, this eye has arisen and ceased in like uh, thousands of times. Yeah, that is, I think for, I think for the English speaking people that one is normally happening when you think, talk about impermanence because I think in the other languages we don't say when somebody is growing old, he's, that is impermanent. It is also kind of impermanent. Yeah, but, but we don't say it, so, for, so we say oh, he's old. So, so we don't have the impermanence connected with aging, but with really things not being like same at all, I think. Mm -hmm. I do, uh, at least I don't know. No, uh, when we look at that the impermanent, a, mm, is, I think. We, we can see a rising and passing even, even our normal, mm -hmm. sen using normal sen sense door. Mm -hmm. It is also gross level of impermanence. Now, even, now, when we look at the Mahahati Padopama Sutta, Venerable Sariputta says, this ocean is disappearing. So, if, if this whole huge ocean disappearing, what about our own, our own water element? 
So it is also hel helpful to understand impermanent. Mm -hmm. That is what we call it. We call it अभिधर्मेंग जाम किसी माट्टा मकटे तटमा मैं क्या निवान्दा की नमः होते थी ना नित्य वो देनो वैंडे पुलवा अब तो ये तो मैं हाँ अनित्य की ये ने कहा था पिटे बोरोस माट्टा मगे ना टिका 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 सिउम माट्टा मग दक्को आते इरुंगा निमिंग ये अंडे पुलवा इसमें तो एका पार टम आते इंटा पनींडो ओन्ने अनित्य uh, so, <clears throat> no, my point, so anyway, there was continuation on my kind of comment was you can start with the gross level of understanding of um, impermanence a little by little get to the point of understanding the mind movement to mind movement impermanence, which eventually might lead to the true understanding of impermanence while real uh, which like precedes the realization of nibbana then a guru sumatta me anitya samahara vela avata nivanda kina kelima upakara vela thiyena then samahara pasuye budwaru gahaka kolaya idila vetena da kala gahaka gahaka kola idila thiyena da kala pasuye budwena etakata gahaka kola kiyanne bahira thiyena deyak ne ida wasse ara samaharu बात दम पटा चा रहा है हम काकुलो हो दिला बात तो रे टिक 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 हो मैं गला आगे नहीं ना देखा लानी त्याग बोल दे फिर ना तब समाहरु पहाड़ दल माय दाने उपलब्ध ना देखो इधर पहाड़ दल निवेना हरे मौकारी हम देखा लता माय रहते हैं नहीं क्या नहीं ये वो उपकार है इनका माय अरे अनित्य सब ऐन में � the Pacheka Buddhas and some nuns and I think maybe even monks, they used some external seemingly gross level of impermanence, uh, not used. That moment was enough for them to trigger the enlightening experience. Like somebody saw a leaf falling, like they getting disconnected from a tree and started falling and that was enough. Or other person was washing her feet and as the water was going more and more, that was the in, enough to in, understand the true impermanence. Another one saw a, a lamp being blown, like the flame of the lamp being blown away or something like that. But <clears throat> so, so sometimes this gross kind of level of understanding anicca is enough to support the very subtlest one that leads to the enlightenment experience. देखिए हम दाम के ना पुप्पा मिलाया तियता इदम में कायो तताया तीना सुबह हाँ क्या नहीं कि एक आत अनित्य पिलिबंद देन मत तो है चंगा तो नहीं दूसरे आनों सम्मान सम्मान दूसरे आनों से कि पहले पहले दूसरे आनों से ही वैसे मुकाबले एक एक प्रश्न यहाँ पे मैं प्रश्न करता है कि लिगोरे लगा था सो सो एवरी चांटिंग देर इस द Flowers are withering, uh, likewise my own body is going to like wither away. So, so that, that is also on the market campuses actually kind of on the side of uh, realizing the anicca, mm. the impermanence. Oh, have I then, oh, you come up with a tackle, you see, I'm, me, me, me. खाता करना हितन मट्टा में कटा दाल दे जब इधर में इतने हिम्मत ये लाती है ना सूत्र लात में हिम्मत ये ना सूत्र उपयोगी करेगा ना मिन्न में पमना तेरुंगा ना पुलवां अब इधर में उपयोगी करेगा ना में पमना तेरुंगा ना पुलवां के लिए खाता कर को देवल में में ये वाके देया खाता करना बहावना वाक ये हटी आव they were just uh, the, on the like thinking level of uh, 
understanding so when you are practicing meditation you don't need doubts स्वभाव चक्कु प्रसाद सोता प्रसाद गान जीव काया प्रसाद अहम बलनागे बलन enlightenment factor of investigating phenomena or the path factor of right view they are basically the same bunch or, 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 and they work in a way as a real eye so the namarakita says when i look at the body hamudru i immediately recognize this is body hamudru i don't have to extra think about that it's immediately i i understand that so if i understood uh, correctly that level of wisdom or understanding uh wherever you like directed that you immediately get the understanding about that so if the mind is purified well enough you can look at those uh, sensitive matter in the eye ear and so on in that way oh then prajna gana kiya kiyana tana den dhamma sangha nipakana na panya aloko panya obasu panya pajjotu panya ratana उदेना मीन uh uh like or or something like that. and uh or you can i think we can call it like diffused life and concentrated life no light no yes we can say uh, yes concentrated or well focused light like one of them is focused and one of them is like ev- all around see mm. let's say then it yeah the the other one is like a gem or like it's a like a higher ground so when you are on a higher ground you can see very well what is all around so those qualities of wisdom are given then anne age prajnawa kathi karaga gena eeta passe ahata hitwemu karala beluwama me chakku prasade kiyana eka ara roopa kalapa wagaya chittakshana 17 hatak tibiye haki e roopa kalapa warga goda tiyena मोहताजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोलाजोला
තියෙන ඒ කොහොමද කියන්නේ ඒ තන තියෙන හට ගන්න නිරුද්ධ වෙන ගතියක් පේනවා නම් අන්න ඒක තමයි සැබෑම අනිත්‍ය දැකීම කියලා කිව හැක්කේ මට තේරෙන වට මට මම කියන්නේ ඒ එන්නේ වගේ එකක් තමයි හරියටම අනිත්‍යයි කියලා කියන්න බැරි ඇහැ අනිත්‍යයි කියලා කියන चक्सादेद वाटर arising like that so the question was do you need to see all of them so the market it's not that you see all of them like that but if you see like uh, some sand you you understand this is like sand you know like if you have heap of sand and you see few of the sand grains you understand the heap is like that so you don't need to see each and every of the particles like that but have some experience of that and when you see that then you really get the real impermanence about those things oh then eka eka hondatama siddha wi hakki kiyala kiyana pulan chatutya adhyahana samadhiyak upadawa gana e chatutya adhyahane nagi hitala me pasa aha kana nase hari we me prasada roopa walata sithwe wama kolot ehema ya we can be passana jnana badala tiyana na e gena denuma king yukta hitiya na चतुर्थ्यान सामधिय पदना करगन विपस्सना उपयोगी करगन सबी अनीगन पुलवांगीना and towards seeing the true nature of the i then you might be able to see the real impermanence of the i etagata enne e wage samadhiya king aha kana nase diva sharire kiyana me prasada roopa tika tika hitwema kala na ehenan aha anithyai kana anithyai na anithyai diva anithyai kaya anithyai kiyala deka bala ganna puluwan wei so if you direct the mind towards the eye ear nose and so on then you might really see the impermanence of the eye ear and so on ඊට පස්සේ චතුර්ථ අධ්‍යයනයටම යන්නේ නැතුව ප්‍රථම අධ්‍යයනය හෝ ප්‍රථම අධ්‍යයනයට ආසන්න මට්ටමක හෝ ඉඳගෙන හොඳටම නීවරණ යටපත් කරලා ඒ නීවරණ යටපත් වෙච්ච සහ සිහිය හොඳටම උපරිමයට වැඩිච්ච තත්ත්වෙක ඉඳගෙන ඇහැ කන්න ආසේ දිවල उंडरस्टैंडिंग उदयाभ्यो <laughs> So the, this definition about the first of the insight knowledges, which is there within the Patipada Nyana Dasana, the purification of knowledge and vision by practice. So that's the Udaya Nyana, 
this uh, knowledge or understanding or rise and fall. So the definition according to the market Amru's memory is uh, def defined like at that level, whatever uh, just now arising phenomena are there within those you see the impermanent. Oh. So it's called the, 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 the knowledge or understanding connected with that, uh, that insight knowledge is the knowledge which we, with the now arising phenomena uh, is the change in them is seen or the transformation is seen in them. ඒකටවට <laughs> So seeing the arising and uh, cessation of those, that is uh, what we can consider as seeing the impermanence there at that level. Mm. May Aramanki and Chatuki at the Hanin Nagi Sitella Balana Katawa, Eka Sahamulima, Samatianica, Samata Hubangam, Vipassana. Even a may, may Vipassana Hubangam, Samata Kilaka Kutianani. I think Kelima, Mula in the Lama, Eanita Terungani, me, Kriya, Vima, Digatame and that Pulua. Ekatama appears should the Vipassana Himakilakia. The Hemagila Gila, the Amtri Dawsaka, Vipassana Yan, Hondatam Vedila, Niver, Hondatam Yatapatula, in the Kene, a hat a hitumokolo, the Kochapu Pasadi hitumokolo. Yata, some had the Gagan Pulwang, a hanit, a Kilakian, make a kill Harieta. So this <coughs> talk about the using the false jhana to see that, that is for those that are called the ones, uh, this Samata preceding inside. And those one that uh, there are this inside preceding uh, concentration and others, they just use the way that leads towards the inside practice directly. So if you develop that practice up to the level, then you start getting this inside knowledges and you get this understanding. Mm. Loku Kriavalia, me Bohoma Gurosu Martami, Ega Patangan Pulua. Gurosu Martami Patangaragena Chatutia Dehane, some Chatutia Dehane Nagi Hitala, Balan Puluang Etarai Deki. Emanto Sudai Passana, Karaganilla Balan Pula Etarai Deki. It has a Sutra Matam in Terungan Hula Etarai Deki. Abidar Matam in Terungan Hula Tavi Deki. Go again, no eka caroling. So you can clarify about the I being impermanent in different ways, the Abhidhamma way, the Sutta way, or through the, when you dif, uh, consider the way of practice, if you go through Samatha or Vipassana way and so on. Mm. Hat a rungata game, Kana Nasi, Dio Sarire, Manasakin, or Komatik Terungan Hariat, again. Paramarta was in Terungan Puluan Oevage, Samuti was in Terungan Puluan. There are Mahatipa Dogon Sutri Kilatin, Mimo the Sindileano. Kaleg, the Hename Sarire, Tianapo, the two again, Kavara Katad, Evidia Hitler, Anitia Kin Terungan Pul. So, yeah. If you understand about the eye, ear, and so on, it's a great job, great thing. And even if you understand at the different levels, like the uh, Venerable Sariputta in this uh, uh, great discourse on the, I think this is like elephant, elephant footprint simile, 
uh, in Majimanika, it's, it's like 20, that's 28 or something. So uh, there he talks about the four gray elements in the very grossest way. So he says the, like the oceans are going to dry up one day. Uh, so the, uh, then you should not even talk about the water element in our own bodies and like in a similar way about the ants and so on. So, so that is a kind of going from the very gr gross massive side, but even that one, Damar Kitamu says, even that understanding goes towards the right way and uh, develops kind of understanding of impermanence. <laughs> Then me locum arganato anitirungan, for them on the Budrajan say, um, me, me, me. Aganya sutri, loke had in Haiti again. It was a Sapta Suri of Governor Sutri, or convina shella and Haiti. Again, eight, uh, Upado Panya, the Vayo Panya, the Kilakin and Haiti. I think a Kamatama eight Kilatin nectar out. For that, you can use these two suttas. Uh, Aganya Sutta is about the beginning of things and uh, sat, uh, it's like the Sutta about the seven sons or something like that talks about the end of the times so so in those suttas you have uh, the very grossest level of arising and cessation of the whole universe basically. Mm -hmm. So, so one mind, the nature of a mind is that is arising and passing away, ceasing. So, and that nature is there in the whole nature. Whole un, let's say whole universe, whole, uh, according whole to universe. today's words, whole world systems have same nature that is arising and passing away. So eye, ear, nose, as well as all other things have this nature arising and passing away. Right.